thought I would put the lights on with you here. Good morning. Today is the day that we get our cupboards, well, the beginning of our cupboards. It's a big day. It's the first thing I thought of when I woke up this morning. I thought, my Father Christmas is coming. We are finally going to have a top-to-toe tidy house. Well, in three days. It's going to be, gonna be pretty crazy. For the next three days, Mark's so <laughs> pissed off with me. He <laughs> said, who would have a major reconstruction whilst they're doing vlogmas? <laughs> Hello, say hello to Father Christmas. Hello. And my little favourite corner. <laughs> Good morning. Oh, you know what? You know what? It makes me really, really want a fire. This. I love a fire because this, this, this gives me that feeling that like I've got a lovely open fire. There we go. Oh my God. Guys, oh, yesterday it was sheer hell. That hangover. That's the last hangover I'm going to have this vlogmas, I'm telling you. Oh, I know what we haven't done over here. Yep, so we're up early to finish off that room. Um, and then we're going to see, because Mark's put some galleries. Da, 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 da. Mark's put some galleries for this afternoon. Um... I don't know, I don't know if I should go out the first day that these guys are here. So I'm going to judge because I don't think that they're really um, going to be um, savvy on how to deal with toffee. You don't really want to leave toffee with strangers, do you? <laughs> so I might stay here while they go to the, um, or do the village after. Hello, village. I might stay here while they go to the gallery and, um, as Maddie's got to be here as well. She's got a meeting. Um, we could, uh, yeah, we just spend some time with her. So, first, let's get sorted for a major build upstairs. <laughs> that will be the end of my story, no matter what Mark says, there is an end to this story. So it's D-Day today. I'm being a bit of a bug. It will be good when it's done. I just hate disruption. Does anyone else hate it? Oh, I just don't have an end. My mum's going to cope with this. She doesn't like change. She's a creature of habit, a creature of comfort. She likes to retire to her room. I don't know how I'm going to do this. I've got to try and carry this. She's actually really. This is really quite heavy. You know where we could put this? It's quite heavy, this. Can I just say all the stuff that's left in here is very sort of like stuff it's... you can do. Just just sum it up and just put it in bags. Because I don't know. What? What? It's like... Don't piss me off, Mark. Look, cushions. Don't piss me off. I mean, I'd throw these out. We need those downstairs. I've got two Ikea pillows cases that need a pillow. So these, I think we should... I think we should chuck them. They're really old. They're all plastic and But we'll have nothing we want... to hang anything up until the new year. Because they're just shitty. They're just shitty hangers. What's happening with that pillow? Huh? What's happening with things like that pillow? Because that's, that's your sort of area, well, that's your area of expertise. Well, I thought you that in the dog basket, in the car. They haven't got any pillows. It's horrible. Technically. Well, that's too heavy to move. That's too heavy to move. Why don't we, move the, why don't we just move the... Um, that sofa into the bathroom, bathroom yeah. and then it's just the stuff up there. So where are you going to put these? You're going to have to put them in the car to throw away. Are there a load in the cupboard as well? Oh, no, there are all the I'll take these out. Wow. No. Oh look, there's another one of those Sophie Conran bowls up there from when Kim Maddie used to be on her top bunk. It's from cereal eating. Yeah. Just found Maddie's um, old stocking. Really weird. I had a big dream last night about the new house that we moved into. Did you? But everyone we knew moved in with us. What do you mean? It was really weird. And we hadn't been there when the house had been 
hall. And then there's a lot of problems with cupboards. Oh, what, we were living with everyone in our family? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, yeah it's quite stressful. Communal living. Yeah. Mm. Oh, look at that. It's up. Sorry, I just turned the camera off and Nadia said the most remarkably annoying thing. Well, no, I was just wondering if we should have made this our bedroom. We've had every room of that bedroom at some point. We've had this room, it's a nice room stops. But, we don't the have sleeps in here, the traffic is so bad. The traffic is awful. You can't sleep. No. And also it worries me, the pollution. Yeah, it's bad. It is. I just looked at about 18 people on the bus. We all exchanged pleasantries. They told me what they had for breakfast. It's that kind of intimacy in London. Yeah. Oh, so you feeling Christmassy? I'll take that as a yes. So subs. Stuff to go in the loft. Wow. No. No, Covered pulled out. Me. Hang on. Wrong camera. Oh, I thought you were going to start talking normally. No, I was thinking. Why don't we, as we're going to lock off that bathroom, put that desk in there as well and the sofa? No, we thought this was the last minute. We thought, right, we'll just put that in here and this is cool. Oh, there's <laughs> stains right. down the back. It's probably where kids have No, it's where, I think it's where water's coming from the window. Uh, we'll get it re upholstered. Oh it's my nasty. god. But how the hell are we? Is it stuck for good now? Careful. Oh. Uh, you're going to have to unscrew the feet. Perfect. So presumably this bathroom's out of sight because I can't aim with my Wii over that Mark, desk. Mark, that's so disgusting. Do not keep that in. Nobody wants to hear those words. That's what boys do. No, but we don't care. We find boys disgusting. That's why we hate boys. Just unscrewing my knob. <laughs> 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 to, me, to me? To me? Somebody, somebody to me? Maybe you could stop that now, Mark. I know. I, whenever I see that, whenever I see She's people say that, I always say no. <laughs> Maybe you could just not watch. <laughs> That's what I don't understand though. I genuinely don't understand if people have a problem, just don't watch. It's weird, isn't it? Why stay there? And... I know, well, I certainly would. I certainly have got more of a life than to go and complain. Uh, uh, oh. Somebody left a comment saying, uh, excuse me, where are your masks? Yeah, and it was vlogmas from last year. Yeah. <laughs> Too quick off Mark the... Mark said, well, that's from last year and I hope you're wearing your mask yeah. tonight. Okay, babe. Yeah, see you later. <laughs> Mark? Mark, help? Yeah. Mark, because I can't hold it, Mark. Just quickly getting my tea. Mark! <laughs> Mark! Mark! Take the other legs off. I can't because it's falling. Okay, I'll be too ticked. Mark, please, because my shop duh. I've just got to pop downstairs. Oh, gosh, you absolute arse. Hurry up, Mark, my shoulder really is hurting. It's going right up my neck. Thank you. Hold my knob. It doesn't stand, <laughs> doesn't stand on its own. I think we need to take it and put it in there. Yeah, what do you other reckon? way, other way. What do you reckon? Stand it in between there. You're having a laugh. How wide do you think this I is? I don't know. It won't, it won't stand there. It'll stand where you are when we've done that. Don't be hey, pulling it out the properly. One. The other one. When you hand things to people, look at me. You let go before they've got it. That's how out of it. You know what? I was reading about ADHD. It's yesterday. so annoying. That is an actual ADHD trait. Yeah. You lose interest in the no, handing not, of no, items no, before people have received it. But you it. see, you think it's losing interest. You don't understand. It's just my brain is is just weird. It's just different. Ah, oh, got one of these. Oh. You can kneel at this one, babe. Oh, it's fine. <laughs> so we've kind of done. Yeah, you just have to what well, it was the top here so they can get up and down, don't we? So what's uh, the thing in all this? Is this in the last part? What? We're going to move this downstairs. It's weird, it's like moving house. Oh, it's really lovely room. It's like moving house. We should, get, like, we should get really nice photos of it. Did you get a nice photo of it when yes. it was all there? And take a photo now, take the stages. Don't you think, subs? We need stages. Fats, let me put the place in. Where the fuck? Where's the light? Where's the light bulb? Oh, the light bulb in the laundry room. Oh, God.
Oh, this is ridiculous. Why don't we just get light bulbs? Well, because why don't we? Because we don't ever effing go to the supermarket because you're always doing online shopping, so I don't think. We've got a problem with toffee. No, I've been really worrying about it. And the builders. We, we cannot have her growing that way. No, it is. How can we... Take Boris. He's got to go. Boris. Well, a lot of people are saying that at the moment. <laughs> You look like you've got liver failure, but you look really orange at the moment. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't say that, that's pretty good. In every photo, you keep getting really orange. <laughs> you do look so, I mean, like, oompa loompa orange. Even my foundation's been too orange. Don't know, but like now, I mean, you're orange. But I haven't got your foundation on. Oh, Mark, don't, you're trying to make me I'm think not, I've got something I'm on being my pancreas. Mark, don't. I am not, you're don't. Don't, because I'm going to be really worried. Come into the light. That's the thing that happens. Come over here. No, don't throw it away. Wash it. Wash it, Boris. You've got to keep Boris. Brexit. No, Brexit. 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 Wash it. Don't wash it. Wash it. Don't wash it. Can you bring the light bulb? No. Oh, God, just for this one thing, can we just... There's not enough light being generated from the church, the, the, the toy shop, the pet shop, the circus. It's not enough light to light up the devil dog in the corner who could be lit by red eyes. Freddie flowers. Yeah, they've just arrived. I just got flowers. These Freddie flowers. Who are they from? Let's have a look. We need to deal with this dog. I can't imagine who these are from. Oh my god. I'm, I'm so glad because I'm loving having those flowers. Oh, oh how beautiful. They're pretty. Yeah, because what happens with these flowers, guys, is <clears throat> when they first arrive, they look a little bit They're not like a message. Dead. And then you put them in the water and they last longer than any flowers you've, I've ever had. Gorgeous. Mm. How weird. You might be just like to make to say, look, you were wrong, we were right. <laughs> maybe. Yeah, maybe just like a nice courtesy. I think that's quite classy. You complained, they said they'd be all right. They were all right. Because oh, I was going to text bunch. the woman and say, do you know what? You, I was wrong and you were right. The flowers are stunning. I think you should. I will. Yeah, I think that's good business. And I'll think of a nice place. That's good business. What do you make of it all, Santa? What do you make of it all? What's that? Hey? It's all got a bit commercial. It's all got a bit commercial. I know what you mean. But I do think COVID's forcing us to rethink that, don't you, mate? What? No, I don't, I don't speak Laplandese. Beautiful. So from beautiful, pretty roses. Aren't they stunning? To a demon hound. Oh, I love Right, Toffs. Toffs, we're going to have to move you. Yeah. We are. Right. Oh my God, should that... Come on, Toffy. Come on. Oh, Off you stairs. Come on, Toffs. 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 Come on, in your bed. Come on. Come on. You have to keep your flowers away from the fruit bar. Oh. Apparently it's Go on, Toffs. Oh, maybe it's for something. Go on, Toffs. This way. I'm going to put a bed here. Toffee. Come here. There you go. She's on a bed in here. Oh, these are too high. Apparently you're supposed to put it half the height of your flowers. <laughs> oh God! Fair guys, I'm editing Vlogmas. Just before taking Kiki into town, we're going to be meeting Nanny Di. We're doing more art whilst we can. Um, uh, there's a couple of shows I'm taking Kiki to. Obviously, art's a big thing for her, and uh, we're meeting Nanny Di and we're bringing Nanny Di back. But I just wanted to show you my flagon. This flagon of water. will probably guarantee that I need a loo all day. They used to call me at school bladderly because I have the smallest bladder. And I just drink water and then I just need to wee all the time. It's so annoying. But sometimes I hold off drinking water to avoid weeing. Is that a terrible thing? It is a terrible thing. Isn't it? What do I do? Especially in COVID, public toilets, which is the mainstay of my outdoor life, they're not there. Is this getting old? Is this what it is to be in your 50s as a man? I don't know. Anyway, I'm editing Vlogmas number nine to have it re-edited, all pre-edited and ready to go so that you can see it when I'm out. That's because I'm a helper elf. And as I edit things, I'm beginning to realise that Nadia is 
an angry elf. She pretends she's a happy elf, but she's an angry elf. Nads, you need more lights on this tree. No, I do. The, it's not, rubbish. This tree isn't good. I'm not happy it's not this good. Tree. I don't know what's going on. Wrong what are you doing tree? out there, given the fact that we've got loads of people coming? Clearing up. Clearing what? You piled that new desk with stuff. I've put it in your room. Because a busy elf can't and be thinking look, about these things. And building here. I want the place to be immaculate all the time, properly what? tidy. I can't live in a messy house anymore. You're the messy one. I've become a bridezilla. Don't call me messy. I'm keeping the whole house tidy now, and your room is a nightmare. A my, nightmare. You're dumping everything in my room. Only your stuff. No, everyone's stuff. Your it's all stuff. It's horrible in my room. I don't like it. It's like Santa's wardrobe. <laughs> the thing about Santa's wardrobe is, guess what it smells of? What? Socks. He has really wet oh, woolen socks. It. And do you know what he gets us helper elves to do every year? Nad. What? Suck the sweat out of his socks. I'm not listening. It's horrible. It's the part of an elf's job that no one ever sees. And I'm okay, sick yes. of it. I want it to be known. Get on with the editing. What are you doing? What are you actually doing? You've got no time and you're, you're doing stupid burps. Not even real burps. Turn it off. Get on with it. Angry health. I told you she's an angry Mark, elf. Pretend burping is very, it's even less entertaining than your real burping. Have you ever done this, right? So the postman just delivered a parcel and he said, can I just have a photo, please? So I stood like this and smiled at me and went, no, no, I just need a photo of the parcel. <laughs> I did my full Nadia Swala off the telly. Went, no, no, I just need the photo of the parcel. Oh, God, how embarrassing. I'm cringing. I'm absolutely cringing. <laughs> They've arrived. They just knocked on the door and they're parking up in the drive and the cupboards are coming in. And I'm pretty damn excited. Hashtag a bit nervous too. Well, my, cl my one class has finished, you know, the one that I go to every week on Zoom, the, class, the literature class. And then, despite my better judgments, because I'm a miserable old sod. Well, you're sod. getting more and more miserable as you get older. No, I, yeah, I know. You probably don't get that, but I am a miserable oh, old sod. Oh, they do. Oh, do you? <laughs> <laughs> Is, um, everybody was asking for everybody's emails, and so <gasps> I gave mine, and I was thinking, don't give yours, Diane, because otherwise you'll have to tear Elliot's house. Yeah. And, um... And then I ended up giving it and we're having a Zoom chat to all get you together because we got together so well. You're on a Zoom hangout? A Zoom hangout. When? Next week? Next week at the <gasps> same time. Oh, Mom, what time. are you going to talk about? <laughs> have you got social anxiety about it yet? No, not yet. I will oh, have good. the night before. The great thing about Zoom, though, is you can just walk out a shot and you're not there for a minute. I know. Yeah. Yeah. It's great for people suffering from anxiety. You literally just point the camera at something else. You just pretend you can't. Pretend what, you can't what's hear. What's all this stuff about Zoom, stuff about the way you look and stuff like that? What's that about? What do you mean the way you look? Well, people are going on about people look much worse on Zoom, like for wrinkles. Well, a lot of people aren't making the effort. Do so I ever make an effort? So you need to make the effort, Mum. No, I never make an effort. Your ear is, like, going to come off. Let's have a look. Mum, you're going to get frostbite on your ear. Look at it. So I don't do that to the British the snowman. Take your mask off. Oh, no. You're very compact, aren't you? Yes, can you do something with oh, my hood? <laughs> your ears stayed in place. <laughs> my ears attached to your my hands. Your hand's enormous, Mum. I have got big hands. Look at the size of her hand on that shot. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Mum, they seem to have got a lot bigger. I'm related to a primate, aren't I? Definitely. Yeah, well, it's like the girls say, orangutan arms. Orangutan arms. And hands, and the and rest of me is very legs. tiny. Yeah, long legs. I don't want to know if you've got a baboon's ass. Shut up! <laughs> and then, and then a little, little body like this. Yeah, a tiny yeah. little body, like a monkey. A Except spider for my monkey. bosoms, which are yeah. There's <laughs> nothing I can do about that, unfortunately. All right, mum. See you later. We're going. We're going in. Oh, all right. Go on. Let's go. Let's do all the way around the circumference. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Xander Gibbs says you look like an astronaut wherever you're going. I feel like an astronaut. Yeah, I've described Sandra. you as an urban astronaut. 
That's very strange. Yeah, you, you are. You're an that. urban astronaut. Xander's very like one of the men in my um, literature group, actually. Is he? He's full of dry humour. Last year it was absolutely rammed. Yeah, I Me yeah. and Dina and Nadia. Oh, did you? Yeah, it's so rammed. Yeah, I came down here the other day from the Royal Academy and it was just, it was like this. Deserted. Well, I guess most people are from abroad here, aren't they? So we come here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Seriously, guys, this time last year it was so busy down here. Me, Nadia, and Dina couldn't get to look in windows or anything. We had those coffees. Do you remember that? Look. Shoe shining going on there. Funny how there's always shoe shining only here in the poshest part of town. Isn't so this is deserted. This is probably two weeks from Christmas. Burlington Arcade. And I guess even the really wealthy people who shop here have to travel from abroad. Wow. These guys are incredible. They've come in, they're just so lovely, they just get on with the job. They've brought this down for me. They dismantled the cupboard, quiet as mice they are. Oh my God, and I'm so excited. I don't really want to film them because I feel a bit embarrassed. But um, I'll film um, I'll film once we've gone. I'll show you, we'll show you each stage at the end of the day. Um, but yeah. So guys, we're outside the Gagosian uh, gallery and we thought we'd have a really tranquil <laughs> rest. Can you hear that and there's another one down there every conceivable drill and nanny die needs a wee and a hammer and everything else Even No coffee, can't offer them anything. They're just, oh, they're just lovely. Aren't they, Chichi? Oh, so embarrassing. You're so stinky and smelly and muddy. But I know there's no point washing you because we're going to go to the PARK. Don't sign around the cupboards. <laughs> just tied at the house again. So far, so good. I'm staying on top of everything. But I've got to be honest, guys, it's so boring. Maddie just said to me, I don't trust people, mum, no, Maddie just said to me, mum, I don't trust people that have got a tidy house. I went, don't you? She went, no. It always makes me wonder about them. I went, really? <laughs> I'm like, I've never been more interested in anything she said before. <laughs> oh, God. So you think it's a bad thing if somebody's got a tidy house? I was really jumping on it. Um, but then but think about it, Maddie, you know, we're all feeling much more organised, we're all more on top of things. She goes, yeah, but at what cost? Did you and Dad today were arguing about tidying up? She said, I've never heard that, your whole marriage. Yeah, but we argue about other stuff anyway. We've just not, we're just not arguing about that stuff now, we're just arguing about a tidy house. We've just swapped it. We're not doing extra arguing, we've just swapped it. Meanwhile... I really had an epiphany today. Because Mark and I do spoil each other every Christmas. We buy each other lots of presents. We definitely do. We definitely go over the top, but we've always done it. And we feel both feeling really stressed. We keep asking each other, what do you want? No, what do you want? No, what do you want? No, what do you want? Oh, I'll have a look. Oh, I'll go around the shops. I'll have a... And I suddenly thought, <clears throat> this is actually ridiculous. We just keep trying to think of things all the time. And actually, it's because we don't need or want anything. Everybody's healthy, everybody's happy, got a lovely home, you know, got my mum and dad next door. 
what more do we want? So, yeah. But the trouble is with my, I've tried to do this before where I've said, right, only get one present or limit to this amount of money or whatever. I'll have to get him to promise to you because he's much more faithful to you guys with his word than he is with me. Um, Hello, Father Christmas. Have I shown you this Father Christmas? I love this one. This is the sort of Father Christmas I would have loved to have had in my house when I was a kid. My mum would never have bought anything so extravagant as this. But he's just so lovely. Look at his glasses. I bet Mark's done his glasses like that. So he looks pissed. <laughs> Where is this place? It's actually the North Pole. Look at that. Cray cray. Ho, ho, ho. Pretty. So, yes, yeah, so just a quick update. As Kiki just says off camera there, Nan nearly went blind. Mum, what happened? You had a migraine. Well, I, about once every five years, I have this weird... Once every five years. It's a very specific well, regularity yeah, yeah, to maybe it. Maybe not every five years. It's certainly a long time in between. I have this weird migraine thing where all my eyesight goes weird all wow. around the edges. But no pain. Well, the pain comes later if the pain's going to Oh, come. my God. So we've got that to look forward to later. Might be. Or being sick. Or being sick. So you could be positing. So you've got all sorts of things to look forward to in this vlogmas. Yeah, like Nan with head pain. She could be vomiting. Um, but look, this is Regent Street, nearly at Christmas time. Unheard of, utterly, utterly unheard of. This is, you can't cross the road here normally. That's Great Marlborough Street there with Liberties. Crazy. So they've been here all day. <clears throat> Obviously lots of um, hammering and sawing and drilling, um, but I haven't gone up there because I wanted to be a surprise at the end of the day. Oh look, down my dog. Um, Mark just ran me very, very stressed. I think Nanny dies between you and me and the gate post has driven him mad today. <laughs> so he's just dropping her back home. And, um, oh my God, this drawer keeps calling me. I'm doing a Mark's day. I've had another date. Love them. Fat Christmas. Anyways, yeah, so he's um, dropping her and then coming back home. So hopefully, They'll leave just before, and we can go up, take you up, and show you what the progress is. Somebody help me stop. Back Christmas. So what did I say in the members' live? And what do I find on the table, Nadia Swala off the telly? Lying on the table? Still going? No, I'm putting it on. Because it's my hat, not your hat. Come on, show us what you've got. What have you got? A lovely surprise. Have you? Yeah. What? So I bought this from Lou Swimming, didn't I? Can we I get do? some light in here so I can see what's going on? Wishing you a wonderful Christmas and a happy new year. Um, it sound like they're letting you go. Thank you for all, your, all you've done to keep the show going from strength to strength. Isn't that lovely? Oh. You've been amazing. Oh. Are they um, firing you? Sally and Tom. No, they're not. <laughs> and look, it's fancy schmancy. It's Ooh. proper showbiz, look. Showbiz schmobiz. Let's turn you around. Hang on. It's Bella Freud. It's Bella Freud. She's very fresh. No, I know. She's not the Freud. She's a Freud. So could there be a Freudian slip in there? <laughs> to get uh -huh, it. Wear that be. at night, yeah. Ooh. Freudian cushion. Mm. It's a very squishy cushion. Ooh. Oh, Ooh, I like that. Oh, what a lovely cushion. Is that a dog? Oh, yeah. Oh. It's so squishy. Oh, it's cushiony, cushiony. Oh, isn't that nice? Look, it's knitted. Oh. It's very fine wool. What are you going to do with it? Well, I don't even put it out. Well, no, no. You're, it's Dogs kind of, will... I was going to say the cushion, it'll be, it'll be taken over oh, by Toffee. Oh, it's a very squishy cushion. Is it? The line I like the bag thing. as well. The bag's nice. It's really nice. I'll put it tight. Oh. Oh, my God, it's so nice. Go away, I've got a very posh Bella Freud showbiz pillow. she got to go away. Can I just say that that thing under that tree isn't working, it keeps getting kicked up? It is working. It isn't, no, it's working, but it looks awful. 
Yeah, because I wanted to hang it on there, but I needed a. You're going to say something a bit bold. I think you're a bit shabby this year, babe. Oh, look at your face. I'm only joking. Please go away. Please don't be you. What? Don't be you tonight. Be someone else. Don't be me. Mm. Be someone else. That's not very nice. Don't be irritating, Mark. What? Don't be irritating, Mark. Come on, let's go see the room. We've been waiting all day. Hang on, I've got a present for you. No, I yes. can't wait anymore. Yes, it's a, no, yes we're building up the drama. No, come on. Oh. You've got to open this. We'll get up there. Here you go. What is it? Yeah, as soon as you get a parcel, you suddenly get excited, don't you? I always get scared in case it's gonna be one of your plants. Ooh. 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 Duvet. Duvet. Careful, babe. It slipped out what my hand. What are you doing? It slipped out my hand. It genuinely did slip out of my hand. Sorry. God, whoever sent us this didn't want us to get into it. Is it from your mum? Uh-huh. I don't know. Whatever's in there will be fucking broken by now. Where are all my scissors? Where well, do they go? Whenever you say that, you always pull a pair out of your drawer, so they must be in there. Trying yeah. to get some purchase on it. Oh, my God. Yeah. <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> Agonising. All right, you you open it. Oh my god! You haven't got split fingers. Let's do this. Look at where the line is. Do that. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god! <gasps> <laughs> Fucking hell, babe! Any time this side of Christmas. <laughs> Come on, it's 2021 in a minute. <laughs> Come on. I got it. Oh, pull it. Oh. Guys, just to explain, my ex is up. So every time I squeeze my hand, a bit a bit of my flesh. I think you need to see a doctor about it. Opens that. up, so it's so That doesn't <laughs> work, that knife does isn't a knife. Mark, get away from it. Ah, oh, the village! There are lots of little bits for you to put oh. in the little little crannies. Thank you. And it's second hand, yes. which we like. Yes. Turn it on its okay. side. Oh my God, don't shake it like a... What is wrong with you? Oh, wow, look. Aren't they look, little people? Look at the people. Look the flower shop. Look at the people. Good Christmas trees. I'm sure it'll they're be a... gorgeous. Oh, sweet. Thank you, It doesn't matter if they can't light up. Look, they're little children. Oh, they're really sweet. The bookshop, the bakery. What oh, those batteries are? They oh, make a little tiny. Now, look, but now I've got my now I've got my tiny screwdrivers. We can. Ah, ah. can't we? Yeah. Oh, and they're made of china, which is quite nice. That's what I thought. Little ones for you to park. That's what it needed, didn't it? Yes, it's just what it needed. It did. Patronising me now. No. Hmm. This is really annoying, this box here. I've fallen over it three times. I have to say, there's not a lot out there this year. I don't think I'll be putting the trees out. No, all right. Because I'll save them for Christmas cake. Because right. they're not the right... Actually, the people are like Christmas cake people. Yeah, I'm going to pull that on Christmas cake. They don't belong. Mm. And so we keep on pimping. It's nice, it's like a... Pr it's turning mad, do you know what it is? What? I've just guessed. I've oh. just realised. It's becoming a Christmas town. Oh, I don't it's... want it to be a Christmas town. It's a Christmas village. It's always been a Christmas village. It will always be a Christmas village. Don't muck about in the village. Why are your boobs so tender? Are you pregnant? Probably. With twins. Come on then, let's go see this cupboard. Come on then, let's go. Thank you. Oh, look at it. It's really, it's very impressive this year. Look at it from here, Mark. Get that shot, look, from up here. What shot? Shots. Oh, yeah, look. Oh my god, it's like an entire Christmas really tree. Really magical from up Oh my god, and look at the see where the see how nice the, the tree is there in the doorway. Yeah. See it? Did you get it? I just can't wait to show people. I mean, how much longer? When's it going to get in the vlog? Go oh on, you go in and you can film my reaction. Oh my god. Oh my god, look. I feel a bit embarrassed. I feel a bit worried. You stay down. Oh. <laughs> I mean, 
No, not yet. No, not yet. No, not yet. I haven't shown anything. No. Let me come in. No. I'm coming in. No, 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 you're not. No, I am. I'm coming behind you. No. No, you haven't seen it for me. I'm waiting I haven't shot it. No, I've waited all day and now you're coming in first.